This video explains how to use the platform that monitors online citizen science participation in the European Union. The platform includes today information from five volunteer computing projects related to LHC at Home, namely Sixtrack, Atlas at Home, Test for Theory, Beauty and CMS at Home. The platform uses Elasticsearch to store information and Kibana for the visualisation. Here you see the main dashboard that features different tools to visualise and interact with the data. At the top left we have the number of users who have contributed over the last 24 hours. Just below the number of contributions including jobs computed, images analysed, pictures uploaded from the mobile phone as examples. On the right we have the map with location and number of contributions. Location is based on the IP of the internet server provider, so information does not allow personal identification. At the bottom left we have a pie chart showing the different projects and the percentage of contributions. Scrolling down we see a chart with the total number of contributions per 30 minutes over the last week. At the bottom is the map that shows the number of contributions per location. This dashboard allows us to interact with the information in several ways. For example, we can change the period of data collection from 24 hours to the last seven days. We can select a specific area. We can zoom to the level of one city. By clicking on the pie chart of projects, we can filter down to a specific citizen science project. This allows us, for example, to select contribution over the last seven days happening in the UK for the project Atlas at Home. We can also create a filter based on keywords. First, let us remove the filters. Typing six track and Berlin we will get all the contribution and number of users participating on the six track project in Berlin. The raw data is publicly available and the standard Kibana tools can be used to create a different visualization of the data. For example, if we go to visualize, we choose a pie chart from the index CS events and we are going to split the slices based on terms in the field country. That would show the top five countries by number of contributions in the last seven days. Let's see the top ten countries. Any of the visualisation can be shared either as iframe to be added to your website or as a URL to be shared. One last remark, using Kibana without user authentication allows us to play with data in a safe way. However, we recommend avoiding the setting to prevent damaging the database.